Yo, it's your boy if you enjoy Dr. Back again with another video. So here's another very useful tip for you all. I'm here with the S23 Ultra and I'm going to share with you how to set up the maintenance mode. Okay, so to set up the maintenance mode, all you have to do is just pull down the notifications, go into the settings and scroll down to battery and device care and then select maintenance mode. Okay, so you will need to set up a screen lock type. So either a pin, password, pattern, or you can use the biometrics. So face unlock or your fingerprints. So I'm just gonna select pin and enter a pin code. Make sure you use a strong pin code. I'm just keeping mine simple for the purpose of the video. And then once you're finished, hit done. And then select the maintenance mode. So with maintenance mode, it helps you to protect your privacy while your phone is being repaired. And it explains how it works. So maintenance mode protects your privacy while someone else is using your phone, such as when you're sending it off for repairs. In maintenance mode, your personal data, including pictures, messages, and accounts can't be accessed and only pre-installed apps are available. You'll need to unlock your phone to turn off maintenance mode when you do everything. Everything will go back to the way it was when maintenance mode was first turned on. Changes made while maintenance mode is on, such as downloaded data, installed apps, or setting settings changes and saved okay so this is highly recommended to turn on if you're sending off the device for repairs that means the service center or whoever's fixing the phone will not be able to access your personal data whilst they're fixing the phone they'll only have access to the pre-installed applications and the settings okay so there's an option to back up your data first. So if you want to back up your data, just select the backup and then select backup to external storage. So you will need an external storage to plug in. So I've got a USB type C connector here and also a two gigabyte thumb drive. So I'm just gonna plug in the thumb drive to the USB Type-C connector and use it as my external storage just to do my backup. So backup to external storage, USB, and you can either backup everything or you can backup just calls, contacts and messages, or you can select custom and create a custom backup. Okay, so I'm just gonna back up just my calls and messages. However, I recommend backing up everything just to be on the safe side. Then hit next and then okay. And as you can see, it's backing up my data. And there's one minute left. Okay, so there's a problem with my USB by the looks of it. But yeah, that's how you actually do the backup. Um, and then next, all you have to do is just turn on maintenance mode. So your phone needs to restart to turn on maintenance mode to help our support staff analyze any problems with your phone. We recommend creating a system log before starting maintenance mode. The log shows which apps were used and any errors that may have occurred recently, but doesn't include any other personal information the log will only be used to analyze problems and not for any other purpose. It normally takes around two minutes to create a log. So you can either restart or you can restart without creating a log. So I'm gonna restart without creating a log. And now it's switching to maintenance mode. Your phone will restart soon.
Okay, so as you can see, switching to maintenance mode. And now it's in maintenance mode, as you can see. Okay, so once the phone is fixed by the service center or the repair shop, and you get back the phone, all you have to do is just tap here to exit maintenance mode and then hit restart and then enter your pin code And as you can see, we are no longer in the maintenance mode. It's no longer showing. And all you have to do is just enter your pin to get back into your phone. And your phone will be just like how it was before you sent it off to get repaired. All your applications and everything should be still there. And then just go back into accounts and backup and you can restore your backup from here. Restore data. But yeah, that's it for the video guys. Be sure to give the video a thumbs up. I thought I'd share this with you all just in case you ever need to send off the device for repairs. Anyway, thanks for watching. It's your boy, the Android Doctor. Be sure to thumbs up the video, share the video, and I'm out. See you in the next one. I'm out, deuces.